Today we're back with our delicious date ball recipe that you can enjoy without feeling guilty. These are great for on the go snacking or when you're so hungry that you have to eat something and dinner's just not ready yet. So here's what you're gonna need. You're gonna need some dates. We have one kilogram of mint jewel dates. We have a half a cup of pumpkin seeds, some ghee. We have a tablespoon of crushed cardamom. We have some grated coconut some sesame seeds, we have a half a cup of walnuts, some pistachios, and some cashews. So all of these ingredients are so wholesome and healthy for you that just imagine when it comes all together, you're gonna have these delicious and nutritious date balls. So we start off with putting a little bit of the butter or the ghee in a skillet and just roasting the sesame seeds. We're going to roast them for about 3-4 to four minutes and then you're going to put them in a plate and set aside. So these are going to be the coating for the date balls when they're done. So adding 1 tablespoon of butter, we're going to roast all of the nuts for a few minutes until they're lightly golden brown and they start to give off this delicious aroma and your whole house is gonna smell just amazing so just roast them for a few minutes stirring them occasionally so that they don't burn and then take them out uh, take them out into a plate then add in the rest of the ghee or the butter in the same skillet to which you're going to add the dates so this allows the dates to soften with the heat and they combine with the butter or the ghee and they give off this heavenly, heavenly uh, taste and aroma that you don't get if you don't add the ghee or the butter. So once the dates have softened, you can put them out into a plate and set them aside to cool down. Then we're gonna add all of the roasted nuts into a food processor we're just going to pulse it a little bit to turn the nuts into a coarse texture and then we're going to combine the nuts with the date mixture, add in the cardamom and half of the coconut, leaving the other half for the coating. So mix it all up with your hands, dig in, don't be afraid to get your hands dirty. And once the date mixture and the nuts start coming together, it's going to look like a delicious paste that you can shape into little date balls. Now you can grease your hands with some oil or some butter and shape this beautiful date mixture into little balls like this. So just take a little bit, roll it out into your palms and then drop it into either the coconut shreddings or into the sesame seeds that we previously roasted. So these are the sesame seeds, just lightly dab on the sesame seeds and it gives this date ball a beautiful color and a beautiful texture. 